What's going on guys? Hope you all well and it is wonderful to be here with yet another aircraft of progress update coming to the aviation community. That of Microsoft flights in 2020. As we are aware of the sim locking or any of the simulators perhaps, a decent A350. Well I believe this is going to be a big step up into the sim of uh, Microsoft for the long haul category of course. The team called uh, Digital Flight Dynamics is behind the uh, A350 uh, freeway project and have released the uh, fourth preview of updates on the 6th of uh, May to be exact. It would have also previously said uh, the 900 variant and uh, 1000 would be uh, the versions they're looking at uh, releasing in the sim. In the video you can see uh, the 1000 variant being displayed here on the co-pilot side. Progress has been made to the avionics. A functional FMS with separator CDU which means inputs can be placed on the co-pilot side as well. Full functionality for flight planning is available so that's wonderful to see. Though secondary flight planning isn't available on launch in this freeware version according to them. Checklist is also embedded in this project with them showing a glimpse of the cockpit preparation. One of my favorite features as we know is growing in the aviation industry is that of CPDLC capabilities and I must say I adore the layout in this A350X project. Full capabilities will be implemented however the final send function at the time of recording is inoperable. More details obviously will come later as to how the connection will be made with air traffic control. Speaking of which, do subscribe to the channel and hit that bell icon which lets you know of when I release another video like this one so that uh, you don't miss out on content like this or any of my videos which I deliver to you guys. A link on my discord is also there if you want to ask further questions or queries like some guys did in my discord. Right. A few more things inside the project there but I believe it's good that everything works and that not only FMS is installed but Previously, uh, system pages are modeled and buttons having movable switches. They also showed some of the renditions of uh, many amazing texturing progress made so far in the cockpit and have done a phenomenal job I would say. Side yokes with uh, quite a lot of detail. Fire extinguisher to cockpit seating, looking uh, rather similar to the real world A350, the jump seat as well. Would this project be good enough than the paper version being worked on by Inibil, which is also coming to the sim? This might pose a lot of competition, but I believe it would have its purpose like the flight by wire team with the A320 Neo. We will just have to wait and see how this one plays out. 2024 definitely looks bright for the world of flight sim, and no doubt a digital flight design would be one to look out for as well. Do follow my other content videos on the channel. Well, thanks for watching this one and do watch the next one on screen.